What's up everybody, this is Dallas Doan here and today in this video you're going to notice that um, it's, it's another time lapse video as promised from last week I had said that I was going to do a video of me kind of just showing how I would do a complex boolean um, using Maya's lives uh, make it live or live object mode and then using that to build it into ZBrush. Uh, and to use that shape um, to use ZBrush's higher end, more predictable uh, booleans. Because sometimes, even with Chris Plus, you're going to have such a complex object that the boolean tools or the boolean mechanics in Maya just does some weird things, right? So, um, now to be honest, I someone who's a little bit more experienced in ZBrush could probably do this um, in ZBrush. I just feel a lot way more comfortable doing it in Maya and faster in Maya using the align tools and all that stuff. So I just did it in Maya and then quickly um, threw it into ZBrush. And something that a lot of artists um, have a hard time wrapping around is obviously it's really good to be able to, to know all of the different types of tools and softwares out there. But it's also another skill to realize that you're not going to be able to do that all the time. And um, to utilize the skills that you have in specific software um, and using the strength of another piece of software to try and get um, the result that you want. So hopefully you like this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up. Follow me on uh, Twitter and subscribe to the YouTube channel. And uh, You'll be seeing a lot more videos coming out from me in the next um, few weeks here. All right, take it easy now.